reset on Friday morning. The sun comes out. It's beautiful. There's not an issue at all during the day Friday. If you're wondering about that lurking snow, I would not be concerned through 5 p.m. So if you have to go anywhere, totally dry here as the sun sets on Friday, but the clouds will be filling in at that point. And then here comes the snow. It fills in a lot of areas by 11 o'clock. In fact, it's getting close to the Canadian border at that point. But there is some dry air to the north, so the snow totals seem to be on the lighter side the farther north you are, more in the middle, and then we're watching mixing potential to the south. And if we put that together into a map, it looks like this. This is for Friday night and Saturday. The heaviest band of snow likely goes right down the middle of our region. So that would be from St. Lawrence County through the Tri Lakes into Addison County over towards Lebanon with four to eight inches plus. What does the plus mean? It means likely eastern facing mountains, but it's too early for that detail. And then the mixed potential is there. And the last couple of storms have not been so great in southern Vermont. A lot of the snowflakes have been of an icier variety that doesn't really add up too much. So that's why uh, we're pumping the brakes on that part of the forecast, at least for now. So this night, we've just got the rain and snow showers coming through. Temps back to about freezing. Could be some slick spots, but 40 again tomorrow in Keysville with some rain and snow showers. Bl Burlington coming in about 41. And then down the road, we've got a 47 actually in Brattleboro. So here's the five day forecast. The nice day on Friday, 35. Friday night is when things go downhill. Very high confidence that the roads will be snow covered. So really, if you're traveling, that's what you need to know. Going into Saturday morning, things will be very snowy. And the high is 36 on Saturday. So once things get brushed away, roads turn wet once again. It is that time of year after all. And by Sunday, the clouds are still in place with a high of 37, 40 by Monday of next week. Stu, Alice. All right, Tyler, thank you.